You won't believe what John Deere's up to. Rumors are flying that Articat's up for sale again, and there's a deer sniffing around the cat's dish. What could farming giant John Deere possibly want with Articat? Once upon a time, you used to be able to walk into a John Deere dealership, buy some tractor parts, and check out the brand new Spitfire model for that year. There was a span through the 1970s where John Deere produced their very own snowmobiles, starting with a 400 model, 500 model, and running right through to a 340 and 440 trail fire models. John Deere produced almost a quarter million snowmobiles throughout that decade, even becoming the official snowmobile supplier of the 1980s Winter Olympics in Lake Placid, New York. So what happened? Between 1982 and 1984, there's a downward slide in the snowmobile industry due to poor winter conditions and the driving force behind the snowmobile program for Deere, Executive Vice President Robert Carlson, had left the company. This made ending the snowmobile division a very easy decision for Deere. The parts supply and all snowmobile related resources were then sold on to Polaris. Yeah, that's right, Polaris. Over the coming years, nothing really came of Polaris taking over John Deere, supplying any of the dealerships with new snowmobiles or parts, and thus ended a legacy. Fast forward to 2024. John Deere dropped some snowmobile merch on their website. Ride the new breed of deer, and the rumor mill fires right up. As of now, there's been no official statement from either side as to what's going on, who's buying, who's selling, and who's in the market. What do you think will happen? John Deere's got something like $90 billion in assets and could easily buy Articat. Are we going to be able to buy tractor parts and snowmobiles under the same roof again? Only time will tell.